What's up guys, my name is Brock, you're watching The Modest Man, and today I'm going to show you how to style my new short, textured haircut using a high hold matte finish clay. Okay, so I did one video uh, showing you how to style this haircut, but it was actually the first time I got this haircut, and it was, like a, it was a couple weeks after I had it, so it was kind of longer, and it was actually a little harder to style, so I did like a forward fringe type thing, and then more of like a side part type thing. Um, and that was cool, but what I've noticed about this haircut is, since my hair grows really fast, is the kind of haircut that I really have to get it like, you know, cleaned up like every two or three weeks, or else it's just too long to really do much with. Um, so I just got this uh, two days ago, so it's pretty fresh. Um, my hair is clean, took a shower this morning, uh, used shampoo and conditioner, and I'm gonna style it using this clay. Um, this is from a brand called 1821. This is one of those brands that sent over some product, was interested in doing a sponsorship, and you know, it wasn't the kind of thing that I, I really loved and could really get behind, so we didn't end up doing anything. So they sent over a bunch of stuff, and um, my one problem with uh, this brand is all of their stuff has this really strong sweet tobacco scent, and unless you love that scent, you're probably not gonna like it. It's gonna be overwhelming, and if you don't like it, you're really not gonna like it. But I actually do like the way that this clay performs, so I'm gonna use it for this uh, this hairstyle tutorial. So here's the clay. Yeah, it's just got this really like old-timey sweet tobacco scent that I'm not crazy about, but if you like it, you will you will love it. But if you hate it, well, you'll hate it. Um, so anyway, I'm gonna coat my hair, coat my hands here, and my hair is totally dry, and I find that. Using this type of product on this length of hair it really helps if your hair is totally dry and you know not even at all damp. So you can either let it air dry, like towel dry and let it air dry, or you can blow dry it. So I'm just gonna work this stuff in. And this is really just to add some pliability and texture. All right, and then for this hairstyle, I mean, you can really do whatever you want with it, but I'm gonna push it all forward, kind of to the middle and forward. And then I'm gonna get kind of like a mini, a mini side part going on. Glue it down on the sides. You know, if you if you want the more, I mean that's that's really it. So I you know I think this this actually looks fine now. It's super easy to style. If you want it to be a little more casual and messy, you know you can kind of mess it up on the top and get some spikes. And you know this haircut was done with uh, scissors and then thinning shears. I have really thick hair, so the stylist used thinning shears to kind of thin it out and and they just kind of made it really choppy and uneven. So it looks pretty good if you just mess it up at least when it's really short. Now once it grows out a little bit, it's hard to get this look. But yeah, I, I kind of just push it over to the side and the front and then get whatever texture you want going like that. That's about it, I'll give you a 360 view. All right, so if you want to get this haircut or something like it, um, I think it's kind of hard to describe uh, verbally what, what kind of haircut this is. So really, I would just bring a picture or a video or something into your stylist or your barber. You could bring this video. Uh, you could bring some pictures from Instagram. But it's a short, textured haircut. Um, there's no disconnect, so it's not like way shorter on the sides and the back. Um, it's about inch, two inches on top, maybe two and two and a half inches at the longest point, and. Uh, and yeah, to use uh, thinning shears and scissors to kind of give it like a uneven, uh, shattered sort of look. Any type of like high hold matte finish clay will work well for this style. All right, if you have any questions about this hairstyle or anything else, leave a comment down below. And until next time, stay stylish.